Welcome to the CKA Certification Series Part 14. In this video we will cover one network related question. Without further delay let's kick start. 17th question is, there was a security incident where an intruder was able to access the whole cluster from a single hacked web pod. To prevent this create a network policy in default namespace. It should allow the web pods only to connect to service pods on port 8080. After implementation, connections from web pods to application pods on port 80 should also be blocked. I will explain this question with this diagram. We have a cluster, by default all pods can communicate with each other, but now our web pod is hacked by someone, so we need to block the connections to application and DB pods from web pod and only allow the connection to service pod on port 8080. In order to do that we have to apply an egress policy to web pod, that policy should be based on the labels and port. Let's go to the cluster. Let's list the pods. As you see, we have some pods in the cluster. Web, service, DB, and application pods. I will show the existing connectivity, for the that, I will use the telnet command. First, I will check the connectivity to all pods from the web pod. You can see the connectivity to port 8080 of the service pod, same as, we need to check the other pod's connectivity. We can see the connectivity to DB pod. You can see, the web pod has connectivity to all pods in the cluster, we have to restrict this through network policy. We will create and apply an egress policy on web pod to the service pod port 8080. In order to do that, we need to find the labels of the pods. We can see the labels of the pods here. If you watch closely you can find one thing. Both the service pods and the application pods labels are same, so if you make a policy to service pods with only based on the labels, then the policy will allow connection to both pods, so we have to consider label and port here. Go to the network policy documentation. Just copy this all to a YAML file. Match label should be app equals web because we are applying policy to web pod. We don't need ingress. Let's delete all ingress configurations. The port should be 8080. We need to add pod selector, so copy that from the documentation. Match label should be app equals service. We don't need the IP block.
we can give a name for the network policy. Just save and exit. Let's apply the policy. OK, our policy is applied. Let's check the connectivity now. First, we are trying to the service pod. Connectivity is there. Let's try to DB pod. It is blocked by our policy. Let's try to application pod. That also blocked by our policy. We have successfully completed this network policy problem. Network policy is a little bit difficult to understand, so you have to practice this very well before the examination. So I will add a few more scenarios of network policy in this series. Thank you for watching this video. If you felt this video is useful for your preparation, then please do like and subscribe.